Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing my Zelda themed arcade block for September. So this is what the box looks like. I think it's pretty cool that it looks like an NES. So I already grabbed the card out of the box just to let us know what everything is. I'm gonna start with the shirt because it looks pretty awesome. So this is the shirt. So it's Zelda and it's Wind Waker. It's pretty nice, like the fabric seems pretty soft. So here's what the shirt looks like on. It actually fits pretty nice. And I got a women's size small and it actually fits like perfectly. I was worried that it might be a bit too tight or maybe a bit too big. Usually I'm a size extra small or small just depending on the brand. Um, I don't know if I mentioned it, but this shirt is by Shirt Punch. The next thing I got in my arcade block is this Goomba from Super Mario Brothers. I'll take him out of the package so you guys can see it a bit better. So this is what he looks like. He's cute and he's nice and soft. I like him. So on the card it says, everyone needs a snuggle buddy, even bad guys. Won't you be a snuggle buddy for a Mushroom Kingdom villain? Maybe all they ever wanted was some affection and are terribly misunderstood. We asked if this was the case, but they're not much for talking. So it looks like you could either get um, Goomba or Boo. Okay, so the next thing that's in here is um, a Springs dashboard accessory, and it is a chicken. Um, it looks like it's one of those evil chickens from Zelda that if you attack them, they get all their friends after you and they are super annoying. Um, so it says peel and stick adhesive base sticks to almost any surface. So um, it looks like you would put it in your car, like on your dashboard. I'll probably just put it like on my desk at work or something like that. On the card it just says, um, we're not supposed to go after these critters, but let's face it, we always end up spending a ridiculous amount of time chasing them around instead of questing and they always seem to bounce away as if they were on some sort of spring. Well now this fella is literally on a spring. So the next thing that's in here is this awesome Zelda keychain. It's kind of hard to see because of the glare, so I'll just take it out of the package for you guys. So on the little card it says, Keychain, the hero shield. A shield is an important thing to have throughout your adventuring. It can help fend off enemy attacks, deflect arrows, and also keep your keys in one place. Cheat code time, if you remove the key ring, this is also a fashionable pendant for your fav favorite necklace. So that's pretty cool, it looks like you can either use it for a keychain or for a necklace. So it looks like the next thing that's in here is a record. Um, it's Galaxy The Dimensional. And it looks like there are two sides, so it says side A, The Dimensional, side B, White Tusk, music by Scientific. And just on the little card here it says, Galaxy is a game we can't stop playing, and part of the reason is its amazing soundtrack. We've pressed two of the tracks to this exclusive, highly collectible record. Don't have a record player? We've included a sweet deal on turntables in this very block from our friends at Crossley. So it looks like it came with like a code if you need a record player. I bought a record player at Target like a year ago. It wasn't expensive at all, so I think you can really buy them anywhere. And now we're on to the last thing that's in here and it's pretty awesome. It's this Zelda canvas, so it has Link on there um, holding the Master Sword, and it also comes with like the screw and everything to hang it with, so that's pretty handy, so I'm gonna be putting this up right away just to figure out where to put it. And just on the card it says, exclusive canvas, the hero's triumph. The hero's journey is a tale we're all familiar with punctuated by important milestones. One such milestone is depicted on this canvas print featuring artwork by world-renowned artist Russ Moore. And this block also came with just a card saying that they're introducing a sci-fi block. So it looks like it's just a brand new block and it just has like Star Wars stuff, Back to the Future, Star Trek, Doctor Who, The X-Files, and different things like that. So if you're into that kind of thing, it's a new block that they're offering. So that was my arcade block for September. Overall, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, I'm really happy with the amount of Zelda things that were in the box. I've seen some blocks in the past where it seems like they only had like maybe one or two things um, that were the theme. So I'm pretty happy with what I got. Um, for next month, I actually switched to just the regular classic block. 
um, because I got an email from them saying that there will be two vinyl figures in that one, so to me that sounded kind of better than their arcade block for October. So stick around on my channel if you want to see that because I'll be doing an unboxing. Anyways, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye!